Industrial ropes can be truly amazing pieces of engineering. Here's an interesting fact. The longest and heaviest industrial rope in the world was used to drill for oil. Welcome to Proxima, and today we're going to look at how is industrial rope made. Before you start watching, I suggest you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss new and interesting videos. It's going to be interesting, here we go. Industrial ropes are made from various materials, such as steel, nylon, polyester, polypropylene, and others. The manufacturing process can vary slightly depending on the material and the end use of the rope, but the basic manufacturing steps remain roughly the same. Material Selection For steel ropes, special steel with high strength and corrosion resistance is used. Synthetic ropes are made from material, such as nylon, polyester, or polypropylene. Twisting for metal ropes only. If steel rope is made, wires made from special steel are twisted into multi-strand coils. This process may involve several twisting steps to achieve the required strength and flexibility. Wire processing for metal ropes only. Stranded wires are heat-treated to strengthen them and give them the desired mechanical properties. Braiding All types of industrial ropes, whether metal or synthetic, are usually created by weaving many individual elements into a single rope. This process is done on special machines that weave wires or fibers in a specific order and density. Stretching and Testing After braiding, the ropes are stretched and tested to check their strength and reliability. This is an important step to ensure that the ropes meet the required specifications and safety standards. Treatment and Protection for Synthetic Ropes Synthetic ropes can be subjected to various treatments such as special coatings to improve their resistance to UV rays, abrasion, and other effects. Packaging and Shipping The finished ropes are packed and labeled according to their characteristics and purpose. They are then ready to be shipped to various industrial and technical applications. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to the channel because there are many more interesting videos waiting for you. Don't miss me. See you soon.